Hello there beautiful and welcome back to The Dark Alchemist. In today's EFT tapping session, we will clear out what makes you feel powerless so that you can feel more powerful. Now today's tapping session is inspired by this week's oracle and tarot reading that I gave you where we tapped into your power and we looked in depth in one of your power qualities. If you're interested in that, you will find it down below. Um, and I thought that it would be a good idea to clear out anything that might be on top of you feeling powerful or to just support you and give you a tapping session so that you can tap deeper into your power. Connected to this topic of feeling powerful is also a 30-minute Reiki treatment um, to reconnect with your power. If you're interested in that and if it's out already, you'll also find it down below. And without further ado, let's get into the tapping. Please be responsible for yourself, for your own well-being. I can't say how you're reacting to anything I might say, so I need to say that first. Stop when it feels too spicy and, you know, be responsible for yourself. With that said, let's start this off by taking a deep breath in and out. Take a deep breath in and out. And I want you to drop your attention down into your body. And I want you to rate from a scale of 0 to 10 how powerful you're currently feeling right here right now 10 being maximum powerful you're amped up on your power and don't be harsh on yourself if this number is much lower than you originally anticipated that's what you're here for okay so let's get going with the tapping please tap where i tap whichever set you want to tap on and repeat after me even though I have this feeling of being powerless, I deeply and completely love and accept myself. Even though I have this feeling of being powerless, I deeply and completely love and accept myself. Even though I have this feeling of being powerless, I deeply and completely love and accept myself. This feeling of being powerless. 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 And all of the connections to the situations in my life where I was made to believe that I was powerless. Maybe it was my parents. Who were unkind to me when I was growing up. and gave me this feeling that I was powerless. This feeling of being powerless. Me 
Maybe it originated from my interactions with my peers. All of these people telling me that I was powerless. All those times they put me down. Because on some level they felt threatened by my power. And in that moment, I believed them. And so I started to learn that I needed to feel powerless. This feeling of being 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 powerless. On all of the pain from those interactions. This feeling of being powerless. And all of the pain from those interactions. This feeling of being powerless. Maybe I picked this feeling up from all of the rules in our society. This image that was projected of who I should be. All of those rules of who I should be. And maybe I compare myself to that image. And I see how much I don't belong there. And maybe that created this feeling or contributed to feeling powerless. This feeling of being powerless. And all of these expectations. This feeling of being powerless and all of the pain of being different. This feeling of being powerless and all of this pain. This feeling of being powerless and all of this pain. This feeling of being powerless and all of this pain. This feeling of being powerless and all of this pain. This feeling of being powerless and all of this pain. This feeling of being powerless and all of this pain. This feeling of being powerless and all of those roots and the causes. that made me feel that I was powerless.
all of those memories of all these interactions that I've had. that made me feel that I was powerless. Which generated the self-belief that I was powerless. The self-belief that I was powerless. the self-belief of being powerless, the self-belief that I am powerless, the self-belief of being powerless. I choose to remember that when I started learning this self-belief, I was in a vulnerable position. And I believed what everyone else thought of me. Not because I'm bad or stupid, but because I was much younger. And naturally I was relying on my environment to teach me about my self-value. And I choose to remember now that I have grown up so much, that I am in the position to tell myself how much I'm worth, I can take control over my own ship. And I am the master of my own sea. And I choose to remember that every time someone made me feel like I was powerless, they saw a spark in me that scared them. They saw a spark in me that they couldn't control. They saw a spark in me that made them feel inferior. They saw a spark in me that made them feel insecure. And instead of addressing those feelings for themselves, they took the easy way out and punched me down. And I'm deciding now that I'm no longer participating in that play. They are responsible for their feelings. And so am I. I choose to reclaim my power. I choose to reclaim my power. I choose to know that I was always powerful. That 
that I was always powerful and that I am powerful now. I choose to feel more 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 powerful now. And I reconnect with my power. I'm releasing all of the reasons, all the thoughts, all the self-beliefs, all of the habits, and all of the patterns that make me feel powerless. I release this feeling of being 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 powerless. I release this old 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 feeling of being powerless. Take a deep breath in and out. And drop your attention down into your body. And notice what you're feeling. Notice the sensations. Perhaps you feel some tingling somewhere. Notice your emotional state. How are you feeling? And notice your mind and what's going on there. And I want you to rate again from a scale of 0 to 10 how powerful you are feeling right now, with 10 being max powerful. And hopefully this number has gone up for you and you feel more in your power than you did at the beginning of this long tapping session. Um, please take good care of yourself for the rest of the day. And drink lots of water because you just release a lot of energy there. So, you know, drink lots of water to flush it really all out. And that's all I have for you today. Have a beautiful rest of your day. Bye.